Hey everyone, it's Cammy. Stick around to the end of the video for a very special message from me. I'm kidding, there's not actually a special message at the end, I just want to try and increase my watch time. <laughs> so, thanks for coming and hanging out with me. It's been a couple of weeks since the last, uh, three weeks since the last video. Um, the last one was a bit of a downer, real, uh, real sneak attack, sucker punch in the girl dick, if you will. Uh, and I didn't want another repeat of that, so I wanted to kind of take some time away, plus it was my birthday. <clears throat> so I'm going to take some time away and kind of uh, recharge and uh, refresh with a new setup. And uh, yeah, so that's what we're going to do today. We're just going to chat a little bit. Um, I apologize for any noise outside. I to open up the windows and stuff. Um, yeah, so we're doing just going to chat today um, because it's important to kind of decompress, to kind of strip away the stresses of life, which I think is especially important now with the quarantine on. <clears throat> um, it's important to feel good. Um, that's, that's a that's one of my big messages here is that it's important to feel good and we need to figure out what helps us feel good, what makes us feel good, um, and inversely what makes us feel not good. Um, for me, personally, you'll notice there are no uh, little icons down at the bottom like usual because I have completely stepped away from social media and from streaming because it was, the world is a raging dumpster fire of terrible, uh, and I can still get my news and whatnot without going on Twitter. So, I'm done with all that for the foreseeable future. I will probably go back, but for right now that's not a thing. Um, so, that's what I'm doing for myself. Um, I don't want to sound like one of those stupid guru, oh, they're not all stupid, but I don't want to sound like one of those self-help gurus of do a social media detox and no, 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 I'm far too Taoist for any of that. Uh, I just like to look at things like what makes you happy and what makes you unhappy and then kind of figure it out from there. Uh, and that stuff was making me very unhappy. So this video is going to be relatively short. Um, because I wanted it to be uh, just chill, just us chilling and hanging out. Um, yeah, because I'm not doing the streaming anymore, I decided to bust out the, uh, the YouTube equipment um, and do a completely different setup. So I've got my good cameras, um, I've got some, did some lighting work, because for me, since it's important to find your happiness, to figure out what works for you in your life, for me, a big part of what works for me is this. It's creating um, and it's trying to help other people live their best life. So for me to find my happiness is, and this is not pandering, but for me to find my happiness is in you guys, in creating and entertaining and uh, sharing stories and helping other people realize they're not alone, how to live your best life and how to help other people live their best life. That's kind of what I'm all about. Um, so I want to make sure that you are living your best life. Um, and so just kind of, if you're a mathy type, you can also look at it like an algebraic equation of, you know, positives and negatives and do they even out and how do I maximize one side of the equation? If you're a nerd like that, like I am, um, 
yeah, so find, find your happiness. Figure out just the little things that you can do. You know, do you need to go on Twitter 25 times a day, 75 times a day, 300 times a day like I was? Um, the answer is probably no. Uh, but if it makes you happy, then obviously continue doing it. But if it makes you unhappy, stop doing it. Um, especially during this quarantine. Um, you know, I talked about it last time, so I'm not going to get too much into it, but this can really wear us down. This can really... a really, really terrible situation for a lot of people. And so it's important that we do what we need to do and that we help other people not succumb to the depression and the the crushing weight of isolation that we're all we're all experiencing. Personally, I'm stuck away from my family. I get to, you know, watch MasterChef, MasterChef Australia every night with uh, with my wife via Discord. But I haven't seen her in kind of a month and a half at this point and it's it's rough. So a lot of people are dealing with rough situations like that, so it's important that we help each other out. Um, so, really, it's reaching out to the community. It's helping build a community that helps me feel better. So, I am curious what you're doing. Um, what you're doing to to live your best life. What little things are you doing every day? Um, and I hope that there, the, I hope that you can do the same type of detox and kind of live your best life given the circumstances. Um, so we'll uh, we'll wrap it up there. Um, next time I'm going to come back with uh, I have a regular episode. Um, it's not just rambling talking. Um, we'll do a an actual one month HRT update because I was just on testosterone blockers, but now I'm on full HRT. So we'll talk about that uh, next time. Yeah, should be. Maybe we'll do another episode before I actually hit the one month, but we'll figure it out. We'll do something fun. Um, so if you see value in what's uh, what we're doing here with the channel and whatnot, then share on social media. If you're still doing social media, it really helps out the channel. Um, check out the, uh, I'm still doing the GoFundMe for the laser facial hair removal. Um, if you have the money, then, you know, feel free to throw some, throw a few bucks into the, into the GoFundMe. Every time I do one of these videos, I do, I put $20 into it. We will eventually hit the goal and uh, get rid of some of my dysphoria. Um, if you don't have the money, perfectly fine. You can share that on social media too and like trans support groups and whatnot, whatever, it's up to you. Um, so I will see you guys, oh, uh, links for that in the, in the description. Um, so I'll see you guys next time. Take care of yourselves, take care of your friends, reach out to your friends, live your best life. I'll see you guys next time.